So for my next project, I'm going to be tackling the long-range sniper bullet from the Wanted movie. So I thought I'd let you guys in on the method I use to, uh, to reference the information I need to work out this sort of project and give you a greater insight on how I break down the project and come up with things like the scale that it should be and how many individual parts I might need to break it down into to get it back to the finished piece. Thankfully, there's two sequences in the film that give me really good reference material. In both sequences, the bullets are done with a CGI effect which can be a little bit tricky sometimes because Hollywood likes to slip in little bits of something from nothing type elements. And whilst there's a little bit of that going on with the bullet sequence, it does appear for the most part that the elements of the bullet will all fit together. So hopefully that means I should be able to create a practical piece that does justice to the one scene in the film. The most complicated element of it seems to be the tip part of the bullet, but by breaking it down into its separate components, I'm pretty sure that I'll be able to reassemble it back into one piece. Working out the surface detail should be fairly easy because the sequence allows for a 360 degree view. As far as working out the scale dimensions, thankfully there's a scene in the film where the bullet passes through a drink can and knowing the dimensions of the can, I can allow for a little bit of image blur on the bullet and going frame by frame and I can work out that a bullet in its current configuration is around 6.5 centimetres long and using those measurements I can work out the diameter of it and the overall length of it once it's fully assembled. From there I've got my reference pictures and the dimensions I need, now it's just a matter of starting to work on it. In the next video I'll be starting up the casting process for the individual components and hopefully because it's a relatively small piece it should come together fairly quickly. Anyway, that's what I've been doing lately, hope you like this one, talk to you next time.